this is Sue, and you're with Get Sold, and I'm with Soul 2K today. We decided to take a walk, and we'd like to share something with you. So we decided to go for a walk in our usual place, and I want to give you a little backstory. <laughs> Behind Soul 2K, you'll see a tree, and you'll see a beautiful rock. Not the, what, what, not the huge one right here, the one in the back one all the yes. way over there. Yes. Yep. The small one. Yep. And so. Um, the pretty big rock over there. So the last time we came here, last time we took a walk, uh, Sol Touquet went to visit his tree because he used to climb that tree all the time, climb up inside of it. And then he would always climb on the rock. So in our last visit out here, something astounding happened. And I kind of learned a, new, uh, a gift that. Soul 2K had, which is pretty amazing, in that the tree had, he heard the tree speak with him, which is normal for some extraordinary people. And the tree told him, what did he, what did he tell you? He told me that right now the world needs me. Mm-hmm. And then we proceeded to go over to the rock. And I asked Soul 2K, well, what is the rock saying or feeling? And it was extraordinary because he said at first. Wait, can I say, can I yeah, it? go right ahead. So Jump first in. he said, first he said, um, stay away or I'll bite. And that might sound weird, but nope, keep yeah. going. So and after, and I also see that he was kind of like mad, but at the same time sad and scared. Mm -hmm. And after that, he, I told him that I mean no harm. And after that, he told me about how. He was here since medieval age, and in medieval age, people used him to make like weapons and armor. So now he's scared of humans because he would, because humans would always take parts of him to make stuff. So he suffered trauma as a rock, and this is something I think we all need to learn: is that we affect one another, whether it's a rock, a tree, anything that has a soul. Uh, we can impact negatively or positively. So then what did you tell him to make him feel better? Um, I tell him that I can keep talking to him and I can talk to him like in, I can talk to him again like probably in the, in the future. Mm-hmm. And I also apologize to him for humanity's sake because you know we can be pretty careless and thoughtless at times but I thought it was really important to make this video because we're coming into an era where we're going to start understanding nature better we're going to start understanding children like Soul 2K better who are here to help us heal things to help us understand our relationship with nature and to not think it's ridiculous to hug a tree or to talk to a rock or to respectfully treat anything in nature, be it animal, plant, mineral, anything, and especially one another. I think that's the biggest thing of all. What else would you like to add? Um, maybe like in this video, maybe we can make, uh, maybe we say can Say it now, because you're filming, we're filming, so say it now to the people we right now. We can, um, in later this video, we will, I will try to get, I'll talk to them and I might have a new message for us. Okay, from the rock? And maybe from a tree too. Okay, all right, so we're gonna go about our walk and we'll see what happens. And this is one of his favorite friends out here. It's from the tree. <laughs> He's been coming here since he was like, I don't know, five?
What do you got? So, the message I got was E. In, wait, are you? Yep, well, okay. I'm filming. E is wait in the future. We all of us will have this gift, and be, and I will be able to see a spirit. And everything will go well, and this. And, and, and nature will be having a good life, mm -hmm. and will now and lots of new species that represent a nature will come, as like living trees and living rocks. Mm -hmm. And uh, the, the future will be very nice, and some and it will be a lot easier for lots of gifts and lots of nature. And I'll be able to talk to him a a lot. <laughs> it will be a lot easier. Perfect. So you're saying he's kind of given us a forecast for the future yeah. through you. You're his voice right now. And what, what, um, let's see, what can we do right now since things will get better? What can we do right now personally to make trees and happier? How do we respect them? Oh yeah. And another thing kind of bad is that he may need healing because his leaves are running out of energy. Oh. like with without that energy it's hard for him to like talk to people Aww. that's kind of a spiritual energy so i need to give him a healing oh can you do We're that now or is that later Aww. Well, I'm sure he's very grateful to you, as are we all. So, thank you, thank you. We're going to end here just because we wanted to do a quick little video. Wait, what about the rock? Oh, well, okay, let's do the rock. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> let's get a final uh, input from him. Alright, now you need to run through the grass so we don't get so into it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Grass. Okay. forward um what rock inform yeah go ahead finish yeah, up okay. and he also said that um he is spiritually connected so he can give me and you Ooh. like any gift oh my gosh I mean, like any gift 
Wow. Because he can grant um, everyone one gift. So you can <laughs> ask him to do a gift and he can send it to you overnight. And this is a remote thing too. Uh, people who don't know, energy is all around us. So it isn't isn't just contained in an object. It's all around us. 